Greetings, everybody. BJ Weller back with you for another wonderful uh, Double Island of Mayhem here this wonderful Friday, July 6, 2018. Friday afternoon. Yeah. For Extra Life, of course, as always. Playing games and raising money for... Not RMG Gaming. Although, if you want to sub and cheer bits, yeah, that'll help me out. Or buy stuff at, at, at my shop, which, you know, is... Uh, let me point the right way here because you know I look at the camera and it's always opposite and never mind this stuff here but over there in the chat yes our, our RMG gaming store with uh, not only RMG gaming merchandise wow that almost does look blue right now um, uh, RMG gaming merchandise but lots of uh, original photography and artwork and more on the way hopefully uh, hopefully even this weekend maybe uh, I can get some more up I know I added uh, I did a couple more things this past week uh, so go ahead and check it out. But in the meantime, this is why we're here, right here. Raising money for the Children's Hospital of Philadelphia. Thanks to Battery H. Of course, $15 in. Uh, our uh, stretch goal of $250. We're still waiting to hit that. Good evening, Taz. How's it going? Thanks for joining me, as always. 119 uh, days ago before we start our 25-hour marathon. $126 in for our Judgment Gaming team, of which... <gasps> Battery H is the team captain, so uh, as always, go ahead and uh, check out Battery H2. Great streamer, great uh, friend from our uh, Star Wars The Old Republic days. Uh, my God, those days, those memories are fading fast. But, um, busy questing blessings. Ah, excellent. Excellent questing blessings. Yes, well, those are, those are, those are nice quests to be able to do. Um, yeah, the, the, uh, uh, the donation quests, yeah, not so much. I'm dreading this donation quest I have to do in Island Warfare. Um, but yeah, you know, uh, essentially that's what Extra Life is. You know, we play games, we raise money for the Children's Hospital filled off. 100% of what we raise goes directly to helping sick kids get, get better. Um, that's really what Extra Life is all about, is uh, raising this money for the Children's Miracle Network. Uh, to save the lives of kids, to make their lives better, and all that good stuff. And uh, hopefully there's enough generous people out there to uh, help me hit not only my initial goal there of $250, but my ultimate goal of $1,000 uh, this year. And if I can do that before we start the marathon in 119 days, well, this stuff will be purple for uh, 25 hours. And, uh, well, however long it takes after that for it to essentially grow out or wash out, I, I don't even know. I've never dyed my hair before. It'll be a new experience if we could, uh, if uh, we can dye our hair purple for our marathon. I forward you the reports and the spin prizes. Nice. Yeah, need the honor points. Yes. Yeah. Honor. Yeah, honor. Very important here. But anyway, let's uh, let's rock and roll here. Uh, with what we got. Let's uh, pop on over here. Let's see what we got on Island Warfare Day uh, 2,802. As a matter of fact, here on... Uh, on uh, What islands are we on? Oh, yes. We're on the British Isle. Uh, so what do we got? We got some wheel spin prizes, as a matter of fact, by Megan that we're going to show off here. We do have another tip and trick to mention about that. We've got some quests, some achievements, and our parish has attacked some wolf lairs and bandit camp. So quickie little uh, stop here on World 1. Uh, one thing I did want to mention, Megan pointed out to me, any quests that you do that have wheel spins, um, I don't know if I'm going to have any right now it's usually the uh, uh, it's usually that one about uh, about refer a friend or whatever uh, that keeps coming up but uh, there are several quests that offer wheel spins as prizes apparently if you hold on to those wheel spins don't use them right away as a matter of fact we do have one right here uh, from a quest which will probably show up in one of these things here. Uh, hold on to them until you re reach Prince or Crown Prince. Apparently, the wheel spins actually level up as you level up until, of course, uh, you go ahead and spin on them. Uh, at least the quest ones do. Um, I don't think any of the other ones do. Uh, generally, most of the ones we get are from quests, though. Um, oh, tre the Treasure Castle ones don't. Uh, we get them from Treasure Castles. And, of course, uh, the Christmas event, we get wheel spins, too. But uh, the quest spins will level up as you level up. So if you get any early on, save them up. 
Save them up until you level up to Prince of Crown Prince. So we might as well save this one because that's sort of what we're doing here uh, on World 1 is sort of a speed leveling quote unquote on two Prince and Crown Prince. Just building up that honor. Leveling up is necessary. As a matter of fact, let's go ahead and level up now because uh, we've used up all our research for the week. Uh, we are third class. We are now oh, a gentleman psychic class. We got three points of research as I mentioned last week. Uh, still ranking here uh, in our castle defenses. So now we have diplomacy maxed out as far as we can go until we uh, rank up past gentlemen into Earl, I think it is, or Page. Page. So once we hit Page, we'll be able to throw another point into diplomacy here. Uh, ranking up defenses. Also through, I also th decided to throw a point here into Castellation as well, just to unlock Sally Forth. Um, that'll be some nice uh, defensive uh, things too once you start ranking up Sally Forth, but not really priority here. Um, even uh, at this point, defenses, um, you know, we, we got the, the, you know, essentially right now it's just armor boosts and guard houses upgrade. So I held off finishing off defenses for the time being because really what, we're, what we want to do now uh, is start beefing up um our farming our uh farming production here um as you can see uh, early on in uh, early on as soon as we could essentially uh we leveled up uh plow and uh animal husbandry uh these are sort of the overarching uh production boosts they give you uh smaller boosts but they boost sort of all the food within that within that realm so you know plow gives hop wheat vegetable and apples a small boost uh animal husbandry gives your dairy farms and your pig farms uh your meat and cheese a uh, small boost and then of course once you start digging into each of the individual researches uh those give uh, even bigger boosts up to the point to where uh individually you can boost up to uh, i think 450 percent if my math is correct and everything except a couple of them i think vegetables and fish are the two that don't go to 450 percent simply because there is actually only one research branch here for each of them so the best you're going to get is 400% out of those, but uh, for ale, for um, bread, uh, there's a couple of them. In fact, you know, ale and bread here have production values, and your hops and wheat have production values. So these are these are the bigger ones. These are the smaller ones. So you can end up getting 450% on top, of course, what plow gives you initially. So veg, you know, plow helps vegetables. Uh, I do believe it helps vegetables. Yeah, so vegetables do get a small boost here. Uh, the only thing that doesn't get any other boost except uh, the specific research is fish. So 400% uh, is the most you can do with your fish. Everything else will get, uh, you know, get the, you know, 50% boost from plow. You know, the 50% the, uh, boost there, 50% boost there. So essentially 500%. Uh, with all the researches in there, you can boost your productivity, which is going to become in very handy if uh, you want to gain a lot of honor as soon as, as over a short period of time. Get that honor boosted in your villages. Here we are in Meg's Padawan. Weather kind of uh, dreary now, so we're not, uh, we don't have, uh, the blessings are running out as well. Um, so we're down quite a bit from where we were over the last couple of weeks, only gaining 50,000 there. Of course, Osiria, even less, just shy of 20,000, just simply because it's uh, not quite a built-up village here. I think I still have um, one or two. Yeah, one more. One more statue. So let's go ahead and throw down our last statue here. I think I have enough gold, only 3,000. Yep. So, or no, 5,300 gold. So yeah, we got plenty enough gold. So we're going to throw our last statue down here. Let's try to find a 20. We got 20 there. That's really what we're aiming for is 20 or even 21 if we can get it. But uh, yeah, it looks like it's going to be 20. So we're going to throw that down there. And that's uh, right now that's all our honor uh, producing buildings built at this point that we've researched. Of course, once we hit page, uh, we'll be able to research the next block. Um, both the, the, um, what is it called? Literature and decoration. Essentially this boosts happiness, your, your popularity. This boosts your honor directly. So, uh, we'll throw one. So essentially our first, the first time we ranked the page 
bang bang and bang diplomacy um, literature and decoration get those out of the way and then uh, for the rest of the page of course uh, more than like more than likely the rest of the page we're, we're gonna hit you know I'll probably finish this off at some point during page um, don't know, may do castellation get that up there too uh, but most of what we're going to be researching during our page is uh, page leveling. It's going to be all the food stuffs here. So we got three points. I'm going to start uh, doing that now. Oh, it's Cat Katkumi, a.k.a. Nadera in the house. Uh, Mrs. sends her regards. Unfortunately, she cannot come in today. She is grandmother in need today for a three-year-old and an 11-month-old grandchildren. Ah, it is what it is. Not a problem. In fact, my parents, my parents are pretty much that <laughs> almost every day. Although, since I have been taking some time off, it has helped that we've only needed them a couple of days. But yeah, usually four, at least four days a week, uh, we need the grandparents over for the uh, boo and the abs. So let's see here. Um, question is, where do I want? The question really is, where do I want to start? with the researches. Um, I guess I might as well go right on down the line. Do apple, do cheese, and do uh, apple cheese and uh, pig breeding. Because uh, they're the three base. Although, although, again, we got everything except fish because we have two lowlands. Um, but really, yeah, I mean, apple, cheese, and pigs are the three basic food types that you will have in every village, um, no matter what village type it is. So, yeah, I guess we'll start with those three. We'll give each one of them a boost. Now, 30%. We're essentially getting 30% boost, so not a whole lot right now uh, for each one. But it'll all work. So that's where we're at there. Let's go ahead and take a look at our quests here. Quest complete. Diplomat 1. So finally, finally got the diplomacy to kick in. So we uh, got that complete. Uh, gathering materials. Uh, so doing um, uh, whatever that was. Uh, gathering up uh, wood, uh, iron, stone, that kind of stuff. So spread the word. Spread the word is the one that gives the wheel spin right there. That's the one. Uh, they will always give wheel spin, so they will level up as we go along here. Uh, fabulous host for holding uh, a one of the banquets, the, the humble banquet or something. I think it is, or humble's the first one. Um, modest for holding the modest banquet. Haven't done much banqueting except for that um, at this point. Uh, just sort of letting things uh, sort of build up here. Um, Speaking of building, yeah, I should throw down a carpenter's workshop. I've got, uh, or no, yeah, I do have, oh, you know what? The hunter's hut, I think, is hiding behind here. If we remember our old trick here. Uh, shift. Oh, there it is. There's the old trick. Hold down shift, and you can look behind things. So there's that the juggler. So I got the hunter's hut in here somewhere. I just don't know where it's at. The dancing bear is back there. Unless it got ransacked, but I don't think it got ransacked. It would still... Show me 30, so yeah. I, I have a hunter's hut somewhere here. I just... Um, can't find it. Oh, there he is. There he is right there. So he's hiding back there. So yeah, I guess we'll have to build a carpenter's workshop next. Uh, let's see, another quest here. Battle hardened for, uh, I think it's destroying 400 troops attacking, 100, 100 troops attacking your castle. Uh, or something to that effect. A couple of achievements. We got fine dining iron, again, for holding banquets. Uh, and defensive master gold for, again, defending your castles, killing troops. All that good stuff. Nothing, nothing fancy. The early level one. So let's check out these wheel spins by Megan. Uh, she got 250,000 gold on that spin. Very nice. Very nice. 
because uh, she did say uh, that she didn't spin. She had looked at this wheel before; it was t like a tier four or something. Then, when she leveled up to princess, it became a tier five. So, again, uh, well, there's little tips and tricks. So, five defensive card packs, not bad at all. Uh, ooh, ten thousand faith points. Yes, very nice there. Uh, carpenters are important for any medieval village. Yeah, absolutely, they are. Filipino. Oh, okay, so that was Filipino for good day. Uh, wow. Looks like uh, Ig Iggy Pop or something. <laughs> looks like what Iggy po Iggy Pop signature would look like. But yeah, uh, yeah. In fact, we'll be uh, we'll be in the Philippines uh, very shortly here. Faith points ten thousand. Industry card packs five. Not too shabby there either. Go take a look at these battles. Uh, attacking Wolf Lair, Snake, Bandit Camps. Okay, so let's uh, let's do the Wolf Lairs first. Let's see. Uh, May oh, no, no, no. This is us. This is us attacking a Wolf Lair from May's, uh, May's Padawan. Just simply so I could kill off some troops. And, uh, and uh, re-recruit troops here. Essentially, just, just to finally get um, May's Padawan here. Um, down to uh, under under our housing capacity because uh, ever since we took over the village we've had more peasants than we actually had housing capacity and we can't build any more hovels um, and so you know during attacks my troops weren't dying defending the castle I'm like okay you know a little bit of a negative honor hit um, I was like okay at some point we've got to get rid of these peasants so figured at this point might, might as well just go ahead send out an attack and uh, this is what we did here didn't even get a report from it so uh yeah that will flare yeah we didn't get anything not even reports our troops didn't last long enough uh and it was pikemen and archers um as you can see 30 and 20 so pretty big wolf flare there apparently but we did that got that out of the way uh so let's now look at our parish attacking a wolf flare malcolm horsey so catapults, pikemen, the, the first line pikemen here, backed up by the archers. I, I, I guess, what's the losses here? No archers lost, only six pikemen lost. Really? Hmm, I might have to, I might have to keep that, uh, I might have to keep that noted here. All right, let's take a look at, uh, again, same thing here, Malcolm Horsey attacking here. Let's take a look at this wolf there. Again, same thing. So perhaps my, uh, perhaps we might have to retire the, the, the corner formation there. If there's that few losses. 228, 10 losses there. Interesting. Um, that's, that's pretty, oh, well, that's almost my, uh, Snake bear formation. The only difference is, of course, is the pikemen lining up first and the archers behind them, or the snake formation. I have pikemen here and archers on the corners. Let's see that report again. How many? How many were sent here? 328, 398, 400. Yeah, 400 something. So very, very doable. Of course, I don't have uh, 400 troops um, in my villages, unfortunately. So we'll have to see. Might, might that still might work? I right, just take a look at them attacking the bandit camp. Here we go. All pikemen, no archers. Pikemen and catapults. That's the attack I got. But if it works, save some archers, I suppose. Not one, the town will fall into disrepair quickly. Yes, indeed, without those archers. Archers. <laughs> without those carpenters. Indeed, so, uh, only lost four pikemen. Oh, lost some catapults. That's not good, especially for only 228 honor. Eh. Let's see this attack here. It's actually the same thing here. Uh, 
Alright, see here. I uh, lost four pikemen, no catapults that time around. Uh, so I'd be JL for a few quarter final soccer in Belgium is leading to the one against. Oh, yeah, you know what? I, yeah, I had thought about that today, too. So I met, because I wanted to ask you when I got online and then completely forgot about how Belgium did. Apparently, Belgium beat Japan in the last match. So nice. And uh, there are the last few minutes I will look there. Oh, yeah, no problem. <laughs> Go right ahead. I have no. I I take no issue with that. My colleague is going to be pissed. He's half Brazilian. Uh-oh. Oh, no. And, uh, what is it? Belgium's leading Brazil 2-1? With a few minutes left to go? Nice. All right, here we go. World 1 all wrapped up. Uh, I think we got everything really we need. Uh, we got our statue building there. We ranked up. We got our research going. Not really, not really anything much to do in May's Padawan here. Um, you know, really, uh, I mean, supplies at this point, I can't, I don't have iron research yet, so I can't build one of those, uh, otherwise just food, getting food in there too, but, uh, yeah, let's go ahead, because stone will always be highly coveted here. Uh, 290s, this is 303, 310, 290, 290, I'd still go for 310 right here, boom, and we're good, okay, so, uh, oh, we're not going to do that yet, let's go ahead and take a quick video break here to highlight a little bit of CHOP, uh, again, who we're fundraising for, for the, uh, Extra Life, uh, every year we fundraise for the Children's Hospital of Philadelphia. Again, 100% of what is donated goes directly, oh, for God's sakes, to the Children's Hospital of Philadelphia for all things like treatment, research and development, staffing, medical equipment. Okay, we're just going to leave you off. My God. Very persistent that today. Um... And at the end of the day, we're real life heroes for kids for donating, and of course, myself, which uh, I won't admit to, uh, just for uh, playing and encouraging people to donate. Uh, you can donate safely, securely, and anonymously on our donation page, which I think, do I even, I think I have a command for that. Yeah, there we go. I might as well use my commands every once, every once in a while, I guess I should. Um, there you go. Help sick kids get better. So let's take a look at uh, this... Um, yeah, at this uh, little video here, just to see how this money helps the Children's Hospital of Philadelphia. And we'll be back in just a couple minutes with Island Warfare. Island, Island Warfare. Island Warfare. 